Hello, welcome to another Friday Fun. Um, I thought I'd do something a little bit different. Well, I always say that, and it's probably always the same. But <laughs> nonetheless, uh, what I'm doing here is uh, this all came about really because when I first reviewed the Artoria Key Lab, which came with uh, the Analog Lab plugin, which you can see on the screen here, I really was really into the way that the clavinet sounded. And uh, about a week ago, I thought, oh, I wonder if I could buy a clavinet. I wonder how much they are these days. I looked on eBay and uh, they were between 1,500 and 3,000 pounds, which made me kind of gulp a bit and think, crikey, because I remember perhaps when I was a bit younger, they were a lot less than that. You couldn't give them away, uh, probably because they needed maintenance or whatever. But it just, the, the sample in the, uh, in, the, the key, in the analog lab just really kind of, I got quite vibey on it. So what I decided to do uh, was um, plug that into the Ventress. So I've just got the output from the MacBook Pro going into the Ventress and then the Ventress is just going straight to the uh, computer. So, and I've got a dual verb going on here. And this is sort of also influenced because I did a bit of hoovering the other day and I like to put the cocktail twins on. I turned it up really loud and I also thought, oh yeah, that's really nice sounding. And this is obviously quite a guitar-y sounding thing. And it reminded me a bit of Robin Guffrey and all of that sort of sound world he inhabited. So on here, I've just got the Ventress and uh, I'm, I've got the, uh, the reverb holding on the latch, the switch like that. And then on the second side, I've got this echo verb. So those two together give me this kind of sound world. So it's really a single instrument and the effects. Uh, and because I couldn't actually afford and don't have uh, a, a real clavinet, I thought I'd do it with the key lab, just to look at the key lab, the key lab's got um, all these, th this is all mapped up. So we've got the, the brilliant tone. And all the pickup selection. You can get quite a, a varied selection of, of sounds there. It's almost like guitar pickups. And uh, I am not doing any distortion or anything. I suppose I could do. And a lot of the time, actually, back in the day, the clavinet, Stevie Wonder, whatever, was, was really heavily affected. So there are lots of other presets in here which have more of that. But I wanted to take the raw sound of the clav and just kind of turn it into something. And that's what I did here. So um, I hope you enjoy that. Literally, uh, that's all I've got to say. <laughs> there isn't really anything else. There's no analog synthesis going on. It's literally just a clavinet, which would be analog if I had one, and a Ventress. So uh, let's do a bit more. Let's try, I'll bring the soft. Get a bit of low in there. So. Let's take that down. So I've got a nice low drone. And I can bring my my uh, cocktail cord. <laughs> 